Back with another one. Kedron didn't get enough the last time, so he's coming back for round two. And we brought the same Brie back. All right, so. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> so today I'm not shooting with a Nikon, I'm shooting with the Fuji XT4 with my 19 millimeter F2. Er, listen, <laughs> it ain't going down today, guys. I had to come in here and I had to say something. I'm going to get my belt over to film this part for him. And he already disrespected me. Now, T, this is my element. He was inside the building last time, and that ain't my element. This is my element. So we're gonna see what we got. Go. What? Alright guys, so uh, obviously he is in denial right now. <laughs> so we're gonna let that slide. <laughs> Alright guys, so like I said, I'm shooting with the Fuji X4, the 19 millimeter. We are using the the cheetah. Um, the PB120 and the Cheetah Stand Quixi Ball 42 inch. So let's see how we make this happen, guys. I, I ain't even gonna say too much, alright? We're we gonna let y'all decide. One leg backwards. Let me see which one. Oh, that's nice. And keep them straight, okay? Straighten up the heel on this one. That's nice. Yes. Beautiful. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. You doing the same thing. All right, open your eyes. How do I see? I gotta see at this you, one. Let you the hole. Oh wow! That's pretty. Oh, okay. Are you here again, right? <laughs> That's it, guys. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'm about to get right here and go in the middle of the road for this battle with Kerwin. I mean, I know he'll have, it's no contest, you know, like they say in the courtroom. So we got Brie out here. She has the winter look, but it ain't winter out here in October. Texas weather is bipolar. So I'm gonna get out here with the 85 from Sigma. So Sigma sent me this 85 uh, DGDN, and I'm gonna shoot with the A7R Mark IV today with the uh, Flashpoint uh, Pro 2 trigger. So um, let's get out there and do it now. Oh. Before I go, I'm going to be using the Cheetah Stand PB120. It's double diffused with the deflector plate inside of it on the Godox 8600 Pro. And then we're using the 8400 Pro uh, with the Cheetah Stand QSB42 double diffused with a, uh, a deflector plate inside of it on two light reach poles. So without further ado, let's get curing this ass with
She ain't gonna do. She gonna do that on Kerwin because Kerwin won last night. It's a, it's a, it, it's a racket. It's a racket. You recording? Rolling. It's a racket. Try. It. See, I only got all wild, so she bet not come I back. I didn't do, but I didn't do Carmen like that either last time. I did y'all both the same. She said, she, you said. Uh, but I didn't do you like that. Yeah, it's on video. Like, really? It's on tape. All right, no. it don't matter. It don't matter. It don't matter because no. I'm still going to win. No, look, no, y'all, Kedrian is very, very amazing. I don't even know. It's no, probably, I know. You know, it's the, it's the hardest one. They get the hardest, the hardest criticism, and, you know. <laughs> no, it's gonna be they get the most hate, we the best. But hey, don't take my reaction this, any this, other this way. This is what Kermit did. I've seen that video so many times. Kermit, because he had the straps on. Did he yeah. go first? No. no he yeah, he's doing it for us. This is Kermit. Kermit was like. Look at the camera. Hold on. Look at the camera. No, 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 look at no. the camera. No. He said, look at no, the camera. Look at the camera. I'm trying to get my Caribbean accent on. Look at the camera. It's Bree said, oh my God. Like she was about to take the camera. Bree was about to take the camera with her. Oh my God. I think it was a smoke bomb. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. All right, guys. Let me, let me go in. Let me come out to the sun. Because, yeah. yeah. All right, guys, so we are doing the mentor versus mentee, and I got my mentee over here, Kay Pat Green, right? I hope I said his name right. Kane, Kane Green, right? Kane Green. So it kind of sounds bad that I say that, but anyway, <laughs> you know? So he is my mentee, and he is going up against Kedrin's mentee, and we're going to show you how we do it. All right, guys, so I, I'm not even worried. I know he's going to represent for me. He's going to do his thing. I gave him a little pointers. He's my mentee, and he's going to stay. All right, guys? Let's get it. How y'all doing? This is Kane Green, Photos by MBG. Representing Trinidad, Crosby, Texas. I'm shooting with a Sony A7 III. I'm shooting with Big Daddy. 105 Sigma, 1.4. I'm about to get it in. I'm about that work, boss. What's going on guys? This is Kedron with 924 Photography and I hope that you are liking the Smoke Challenge Part 2. Now we have so much that's going to go on today, I want you to stay tuned. But first of all, I want you to share this and like and comment below if you would like to see Episode 3. Today we're using the Mars 400S Pro to do all of this transmitting so we can see as far as video goes. Now, Chris Martin from Houston, Texas. I've been teaching him, and he is going to go against Kane. Kane has been mentored by Kerwin, and we're just gonna see, at the end of the video, I want you to see who shots were the best from our mentees. So without further ado, let's get started right now. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Chris, all the way from Houston, Texas, with 126 Photography, and today, I am going to give the smoke to my man, Kane Green. He called me out. He said he wanted a challenge, and I'm going to give it to him. 
I am uh, been studying under uh, 924 photography, and uh, he said he want that smoke, so I'm about to give him that action. You know what I mean? So you gotta stay ready to get ready. You know what I mean? Let's go. So when I'm out on location, I'm always needing a, uh, you always need either variable ND filters or filters. Well, Freewell sent me these magnetic filters out that make such a big deal in my uh, everyday filming. It just makes it so easy. Now, we all know Freewell, they do sell variable ND filters where you can just turn them off and you're good to go. Well, these filters right here are magnetic, so I can just take them off and Pretty much all of them almost weigh the same, especially like in the 67 millimeter range. And like I have a, uh, they sent me out an ND64 and an ND1000. So if I need more, all I gotta do is just take it off and pop it on and I am good to go. So the link will be in the description below for these Freewell filters. It ain't really much else I can tell you about them besides the quality is definitely really good. So if you don't, uh, can't afford like the Polar Pros or something like that, you can definitely get these filters. As you can see right now, I am filming, um, as you can see right now, I am filming Aaron, filming me, and the quality looks good. Um, and I'll take it off now, as you can see. Boom, that's just a 64 filter. And I'm shooting with the A7S Mark III so I'm at ISO 640, which is the native ISO for this camera. And then I put it on and boom, look what we have. So again, the link will be in the description below. Tell them Kilo sent you. Just click the link. They'll know anyways. Did y'all think we were? it was over? No, the smoke is never over. So me and Kurt will have one more challenge. So if y'all already, y'all should already voted before. Y'all seen the images. Make sure you go down in the comments below and Tell us, honestly, who you like the best because we're, at the end of the day, we're all content creators and we're all having fun out here, but we're bringing this challenge to you because we want to have more entertainment. Now, let me tell you, me and Kerwin do not have beef. We are good friends. He is sitting right over here to the uh, right side of me and we are having fun. But again, this is entertainment and it is competition because competition over community every time. Now, we are about to do our second challenge, which will be the last one for the day. We are sitting in the Dallas area and I have something in store for Bree. We're gonna use the two light setup. Again, the 120 by Cheetah Stand and the QSB 42 with an 8400 as my backlight and an 8600 Pro as my main light. Now, one thing I do want y'all to say, if y'all wanna know the power levels, I'm probably not gonna remember them. Um, so if you wanna do all of that, you should probably come to one of my workshops, right? Right. Boom. And Bree comes to some of my workshops. She hasn't been done. She's been busy, but we definitely gonna have her either at the end of the year or at the beginning of the year to start it off. So stay tuned for her. Tell them yes. where they can find you at. You guys can find me on Instagram at Brie underscore B-R-I-W-O-A-H underscore. So when you say Brie Whoa, it's yes. like Brie Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, okay, like, okay. Whoa. How, how did you come up with I don't know. I was like 16, 17, and, and, and the guys were walking by them like, dang, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I was actually going through my ugly duckling phase at that time, so no. I don't know what made me come up whoa, with whoa, whoa, hold on. Ugly duckling? Come yeah. on now. Are you serious? Yes. The, acne, Bring the, your... the braces, all that. Yeah. Yes. I think braces were cute. My wife had braces, so I mean, I, I don't think they were like bad, them. but you know, I definitely had metal in my mouth. Well, I guess, you know, I went through my ugly duckling stage until I, until I wasn't. And now I'm back in it. Period. And I'm 40. Now we, <laughs> now we out here looking beautiful uh, swans. <laughs> yes. So again, guys, I want y'all to subscribe to everybody. 
make sure you go down in the description below because all their everybody that helped today will be in the description below and follow their channels Kerwin has a youtube channel 126 photography he has a instagram channel uh a a ron has an instagram channel uh channel uh q and um kane over here has one and you know you should definitely follow us because we are here doing this content for us and for you, but to just kind of educate you. So, next up is Kerwin. He's gonna tell y'all what we're gonna do, and let's get this stuff started. We, how to say that, I just wanna strengthen something that Keydrin said. As you guys can see, this is just friendly competition. So it's, there's no beef, that's my boy. You know, we love each other. We always support each other. So I just wanna stress that again, you know what I mean? So, my set, I'm shooting again with the Fuji X-T4 with the 90 millimeter. I might switch it up and shoot with the 23. Um, we'll see how it looks depending on the composition I'm going for. But guys, it's it's over already. From the first shot, you heard the model. You heard the model. I mean, come on. Do I need to say more? I don't need to say anything more. You know what I mean? So stay tuned. This is the second set. Y'all gonna see it. And again, like I said in the first one, y'all know my name by now. So if y'all watching this <laughs> and y'all still don't know my name. This definitely gonna put y'all on. Y'all gonna definitely be on my name. Alright? <laughs> <laughs> this real quick because I had a whole conversation about this with um, Lonnie where we were saying like um, settings and exit data don't matter because everything is different so Kedron just did his his set right and you're gonna see his images now with me my style of shooting is completely different to him so with his set he used the inner diffuser he used the beauty dish and he used the outer diffuser so he had three layers of diffusion for my style of shooting, that's not gonna work. That's not enough power. I shoot full power. So I'm shooting with just the outer diffuser on this. So you see, so my settings would be completely different than his. So with this now, I'm gonna shoot at like one eight thousandth of a second, whereas with him, he would shoot like one two, two, a thousand two hundred fifty of a second or something. So that's why we always tell you guys that knowing the exit doesn't really matter, you know?
all right guys so i hope you enjoyed that video and if you did don't forget to subscribe comment down below like the video and make sure you follow everybody on that is in the video guys make sure you follow everyone we appreciate the support and yeah until the next one see y'all